approximate distance, about 400 meters offset from us. That second compound is the one that the snipers were saying they were shooting okay. from. Uh, we went on as a, basically a security patrol. Basically, when we got out there, though, we looked for a good position to set up in. And uh, as we were moving to find a position that we wanted to, to set up in, we ended up getting hit by an improvised explosive device. Uh, following hitting the improvised explosive device, we ended up uh, dismounting to do normal sweeps for, uh, for possible secondaries. Um, the vehicles were moved forward a little bit of uh, where the actual IED was. We started taking small arms fire and uh, sniper fire from our east and southeast sides uh, within one of the, from one of the compounds to us a couple hundred meters off. In your main, this is Anger 5. We ended up having another patrol come down south from us. They, they started sweeping from the south to the southeast side of us clearing all the other compounds as we were holding the cordon off on the IED. Um, once EOD finally got out there, it was already past dark. We had to switch to our uh, to our thermals and uh, using the night vision goggles and everything just to make sure that we were still maintaining that good security on our vehicles in the cordon. As they uh, as EOD got in everything, they ended up checking out the IED spot, uh, finding out it was only a partial blast and that it was uh, ended up being an 80 pound explosive at maybe only 15 pounds that ended up exploding. Um, they ended up detonating what was left of it. And at that point, we uh, we linked up with the Quick Reaction Force and ended up making our uh, way back to uh, to Camp Leatherneck.